I'm rocking the brown eyes for this video because I haven't had my brown eyes out, my natural eyes out in a minute. So we're going to have them out today in this video. And the puff is looking big, you guys. The puff is looking big. Do you guys wanna know my secret? <laughs> I'm just kidding, I don't have one. First off, I wanna know how the lighting is. How is the lighting for you guys? Because I know that my videos haven't really been giving the best quality, I guess you could say, with the lighting and like, I don't know, things could be better, things could be improved. So how is the lighting in this video? Please let me know in the comments below and if it's good, if it's bad, if it's too light, too dark, whatever, let me know, okay? But for today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you guys my lip care routine and how my lips stay soft and moisturized, I guess, uh, throughout the day. So I kind of wanted to share with you guys what I got and like how I'm doing the routine and everything. If you guys watch my Ulta haul, then you guys have seen some of these products in that video. If you haven't, I will link it up in the cards for you to go watch that video. But in this video, I'm just gonna be sharing the lip products that I have so I wanted to show you guys the way my lips look now with nothing on them no lip treatment no lip mask no like any sort of chapstick lip gloss whatever just my bare lips so this is how my lips look with nothing on them they're feeling pretty dry so I need to hurry up and get something on them but I have nothing on my lips and there's no sort of um like peeling or anything I used to deal with a lot of that um because I lick my lips a lot and that makes them even drier so if your lips are dry don't lick your lips but I just do that I don't know it's a habit it's a habit for everyone but I know that when I lick my lips, my lips are a little bit more on the drier side. So that's why I like to use lip treatments instead of licking my lips as often. But um, I noticed that my lips are on the drier side, but doing these things have really helped to get them looking like this because um, yeah, my lips can be pretty chapped and pretty dry. If you look at like my other videos and you look at my lips, my lips are pretty dry, like let's be honest. So yeah, these tips have helped me to keep my lips looking a little bit more on the moisturized side whenever they don't have anything on it. So I'm gonna share with you guys today. So the first thing, we're just gonna get this out the way. This is just the holy grail basic. If you're not doing this, then you have to be doing this, okay? And I'm sorry, but it is to just drink water. You have to be drinking water. You have to hydrate your body from the inside to get your body looking hydrated on the outside. If you're not drinking water, your lips will not be moisturized no matter how much product you're using or it's just not gonna last. Like it's not gonna last as soon as the product goes off or comes off of your lips, then your lips are gonna start to feel dry. So drink water, you have to be drinking water in order for your lips to stay hydrated. I'm sorry, but it's just... So I only have four um, lip products right here. So the first one I've already mentioned is the Tree Hut Sugar Scrub um, in Sweet Mint. So it looks like this. Um, I've shown you guys already in the Ulta haul video, so I'm going to be showing you guys how I actually use the product. So I'm going to take a little bit from the cap, like that much, and then I go in circular motions. So I hit it all over, and I do this for about two minutes. And I really make sure to get the corners, to exfoliate the corners of my lips. Okay, so after I'm done like exfoliating, then I rinse it off with some water. I don't know if this is edible, probably not. I don't know, but it has sugar in it, so it should be edible. But I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna go rinse this off and then I'll be right back. Okay, so now that our lips are exfoliated, they're looking like this. And it's really moisturizing. Like it leaves my lips pretty hydrated for the most part. And it feels like I don't have to put anything on top of it. But I do. I do. I have to. I just have to. Because I like when my lips are moisturized now. Because you can tell when somebody is like not drinking enough water by their lips. And 
that's like a dead giveaway and you were able to see that I was not drinking enough water. And now I'm drinking so much water, it's ridiculous. So now I'm going to take this Milani Rose Butter Lip Mask. Um, and you can leave this on overnight, but for the sake of this video, I'm just going to leave it on for like 10 minutes. Okay, so the lip mask is applied. My lips are looking super moisturized. And I'm going to leave them on for about 10 minutes. So it's 10.04 right now. So I'm going to come back at 10.14. And then I'm going to take it off. And then I also have another lip mask by Laneige. I believe I mentioned this in one of my older videos. But um, it looks like this. And I don't usually use this as a lip mask. I use it as um, like a lip balm. So I just like wear it throughout the day and then, you know, that's really it, I guess. So I guess it's a lip mask because you're keeping it on your lips for a long period of time. But I don't use it as that, I guess. But I also use um, Aquaphor for my lips as well. Um, this really helped me when I was on Accutane and my lips were like super, super, super dry. So this really is like the holy grail o2 o2 og okay um yeah so i have the laneige lip sleeping mask and i'm gonna apply after this one so i will be back to show you guys that okay everyone so it's been 10 minutes so i'm going to remove the mask with just a wet um cotton round And, of course, my battery is about to die. One second. Okay, sorry about that. So, I took the mask off, and this is how my lips are looking after the mask. So, now I'm going to probably just apply the Laneige and then use the Aquaphor at night. I usually end up doing that because I leave the Aquaphor near my... Um, uh, bed near my nightstand and then this is um, in the cabinet with all my other products so I usually do it this way anyway so I just apply it all right and that is how I get my lips to look like this um not really much to it uh, there's only three products here besides the aquaphor it's not really special products so yeah but that is basically all that I do to get my lips looking like soft and hydrated. Um, but the main key is drinking water, you guys. Just make sure you are drinking your water and staying hydrated and your body will be hydrated as well, showing that on the outside. But I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know how you liked it and if you found any of these things helpful. And also let me know how the lighting is and everything like that. But that is it for today's video, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to follow me on all my social medias, my TikTok and my Instagram. Hey, you guys. Also, I wanted to add into this video, um, my memory card is in my laptop, so it's not in my camera. And I just didn't feel like doing all that, so that's why I'm recording on my phone. But I also wanted to mention that I am starting a podcast, so I will leave the details of my podcast down in the description box below. If you guys wanted to go check it out. And yeah, that's all I wanted to mention is that I'm creating a podcast but okay back to the video make sure to like this video and subscribe to my channel down below but i love you guys and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys